So Looney and Kristaps Porzingis to jump it up. So Monte Morris will handle. And for the Warriors, did they get into a tight game in the fourth quarter? Because that's when the tension really going to start to build a chase center. Kristaps Porzingis putting it up and in. And they just need their big three to be healthy now. Yeah, how Kuzma's out, but when they're on the court together, they played really well. Scoring teams. And Thompson rails the three. Probably isn't going to be able to chase Clay around all night. They're going to test that. Porzingis has Clay on a switch. Big step in the lane and putting it up and in. And see how aggressive he is calling for it at the small defender. Clay terminated the dribble. Looney with the shot clock at five. Two men jump and play. Top fading deep two and he made it. Bradley Beal got whacked. Monte Morris at high screen roll with Porzingis. And lobbing it to Gafford who leads the league at 77% shooting. That's a great closeout by Wiggins. He Amazing. can't be more on top of a guy. They ran that play for Bradley Beal. He got through that screen. JP3 dropping in the triple. And a great screen by Draymond Green. If you try to avoid it, you play into his hand and his rim protecting skills come out. When you go like that, he can't block. Beal gets downhill to finish. It's on the deck and he somehow got it to pull for the basket. Wow. Then he be down. Missing there and Bradley Beal rimming it in. Washington on 70% shooting through three quarters. 60% tonight. Michael Green hitting a three. That's Jordan Poole's playmaking ability and vision. Bradley Beal, when he plays, Washington is a better team. He has Kaminga on skates. That was dirty. There's too many moves. Oh, no. Then the turnover in the backcourt. Doesn't lose contact with Washington. And Kendrick Dunn, DiVincenzo, Jermichael Green going to take a turn on Porzingis. Porzingis. Flip one in, and now Jamichael had four fouls against the Lakers. 80 point first half for Washington in their last game, shooting 70 percent. Well, trying to work on a 40 point first quarter here. Delon Wright makes it 39. Domingo, Henry Dunn hustled back to stop any break with only one left. Takes a three. That's a good way to end the quarter. You needed that in the worst way. I don't think the Wizards are going to slow down offensively, so at some point for the Warriors, this is going to be a tough one. You see, the Warriors have 10 fast break points, too. Anything they can get in transition, the long right hitting the deep jumper. Running out the eye, put it up and out. He grabs his own offensive rebound and sets up Gafford, who never misses at 77%. Except they just did this in their last game, right? They get three. Oh, how did they come in? Bring up their intensity, see if they can uh, snatch this momentum. Play right down the lane. Clay Thompson, field goal and a foul. Gafford holding to set up Kispert. Well, you know he's the three point shooter. Shot clock at three, and even Chenzo the steal. Even Chenzo, the foot race and the finish. The Wizards are going to make that tough, though. And both benches are playing very well. Ah, nice pass inside. You just didn't have side of the ball there if you're Kaminga. He's pointing to himself. Pick up dribble and then two steps after that. The gather one, two. He's allowed in the league. Wiggins had it knocked away, got it back. Shot clock at five. Even Chenzo, three. John Wall for a while with quite the guard tandem in the back of the zone. Ty Jerome driving that zone, floats it up and in, and will get to the line. Man, if the Warriors can have the lead at halftime, that would be demoralizing for the Wizards. Dante missed the three, Ty Jerome, look what I found! Clay Thompson, three. Wiggins switched on to Beal and just contained, made a tough shot. Warriors looking for the lead here. Ty Jerome, push shot, and they've got it! From 15 down, the Dubs on top. Went back to that old, reliable push shot game. 
Porzingis. Nice drop pass to Bradley Beal. Good five minutes of basketball and a couple rebounds and some pretty good D. He's got such a great attitude. He's always going to stay ready. Beal. He is a good scorer at all levels. Play hiding behind Looney. Henrik Nunn top locking him. Staying with him. And Clay cut without the ball. Looney the rebound, four seconds to work with, three on the way, Looney again, finishes the half! Not reacting in time. Bradley Beal, Clay moving his feet, and Beal's that good. That's the NBA right there, good offense beats good defense. Raymond waiting for friends. Poole, set shot three. Took his time with that one, got his legs into it. Porzingis really hadn't gotten a touch yet. Now he's got Wiggins on the switch. They clear the side for him. That step back jumper. At 7-3, just not going to get to it. You can't play him any better than that. Uses the Gafford screen, and now Beal. Looney. And stay with him on the turn and fade. Bradley Beal. And Poole sidestep three. And Looney another rebound. He's got double digits. Michael Green three. I'm just happy to see him get back up. That, that looked like a nasty fall. Heel down the lane. He's going to hit the deck again and still make a basket. Got clock at eight. Glad Jerome at five. Play foul line jumper. Everything doesn't need to be a three. That was well done. His defender wasn't in position. Just kind of faded off of that right into that elbow jumper in rhythm. Porzingis thought about that three. The big step down the lane. And flip it in and draw another foul. Rebuilding the lead to nine. Three and a half remaining in the third. Wiggins three. Andrew Wiggins. The work on Abdia. Andrew Wiggins. With a kick out. Michael Green's got to shoot that three. And he makes it. Shot clock at eight. And knock it away. Ty Jerome had the strip. The save in and still loose on the deck and right to Jamichael Green. <laughs> Crazy sequence is Ty Jerome setting up Jamichael. Trail three. Yes, sir! Henry Knott very clever with that left hand and rattles it home. Final minute of the third. Ty Jerome dropped it off to Jamichael Green. They had nothing working there. Kidding me. The line right will get a dunk to end the quarter. He's pretty dynamic. He can get penetration. He's got some quickness. Looney inside one more time. And this is nice to see. Wiggins left wing three, and Clay will track it down. He was boxing out the line right. Draymond into Wiggins inside. Minute drought in Portland, three and a half minute drought against the Lakers in the fourth. Michael Green and Looney down the lane, and there's going to be no drought tonight. And to work on Wiggins, Andrew turned him away. Shot clock down to two. Beal's got to make something out of nothing. Step back three. He is something. 33 for Bradley Beal. Sitting there, a nine point game. You got to be very solid the final two minutes to take care of the ball. Not like that. Stolen by Kispert, and Kispert dunking it down. They go back to the cross screen, Andrew Wiggins in the post. And clear aside for Wiggins. Spins, fades, fires, got it! 29 for Wiggins. That Portland Laker taste out of your mouth. And head to L.A. for the final game before the break to take on the Clippers.